Hi everyone, today we're going to look at something called capillary action. What you'll need are some glasses, some food colouring, paper towels and that's it, a bit of water. Great! Now what I first of all do with my paper towels is I cut them up and I just cut them into half each so they're a lovely strip like that so they can fit inside the glasses. And then with the food colouring I put them into the water, about 10 drops, the same amount, 10 drops in each glass. I've got red, two lots of red and I'll show you why in a minute. Red, yellow and blue. These colours are all our lovely primary colours and we can see why soon as well. Okay, first of all when you've cut, once you have already cut the um, strips up, then what you do is this, you place them like this. Put the red one there and I'm going to put the just about that far apart and I'm going to put the blue next. Another bl um, plain glass, let's get some straight like that so we can see. And then the yellow there. Now I'll put the red one up the end again. Fantastic. Now the next thing I'm going to take our paper and put it in here and drop it carefully and just push it in like that. Okay? And we'll take the next one and we put it inside here and we're going to drip it Drop it into the blue. This one here going from the blue into the empty glass again. I'm going to take the, this one here from the empty glass, go into the yellow. Keep going. I'm going to take this one here from the yellow. And put it into the empty glass and the last one from the empty glass back into another red. Right and just pop them down they don't need to go too high above. Now you'll see already what's happening is that the colours are starting to run up the paper towel. You think well, how can things go uphill? There with gravity everything goes down but that's where the capillary action comes in. Each of our paper towels is made of very, very fine fibres and inside them there are gaps in the fibres and what the water does is like it gets sucked up, up the fibres and that's why it travels up like this. And using the food colouring we can see what's going to happen. How I'd love you to have a crack at this at home and when you do, you leave this for a few hours or you have a look and then go for a, away for a little bit, then have a look again and watch what's going to happen over the next couple of hours. This capillary action um, process here is the same thing that plants use when they are bringing up nutrients and water from the roots to the leaves and the rest of the plant. Have a look as well, if, if you want, what you could do is get rid of the last glass and make them into a loop connecting this one back to here. Let me know how you go. All the best. Bye now.